What is good, everybody? Welcome back to Real Fan Sports. My name is Zach, and I'm here with my partner, Nonfiction. What's good with you, brother? I'm good, brother. How about yourself? How you doing? I'm doing good today, man. We got another banger of a reaction in the soccer slash football world, and apparently this is a young up-and-coming star, someone that Ooh. people think may turn out to be the next great, which is really? you know crazy considering, I believe in this highlight clip, he's playing in U16. I think this is actually his first year as a professional footballer. Interesting. This will be interesting to see, especially if we see somebody before they become big and be like, oh, we, we did that. <laughs> we were there. <laughs> we were there, right. So this is Lamine Yamal. Full season show for 2024. This was sent to us through Sajit through our request form, which is down oh, below Sajid. in the description. So if anyone yeah. has any more requests for uh, for us, you can go ahead down below. Request for RFS. I recognize to us. that name. I've seen him plenty of times on stream. <laughs> right, right. Let's do it. And as this disclaimer say, that works for us too, right? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Shout out to Brazil Scout, the creator of this video. Yes, this is clearly for entertainment and educational purposes. Yeah. All, right, all right actually okay. i didn't want to yeah, pause, pause we, we pause talked a lot in the beginning but i want to read this so we got uh best at attributes flair dribbling agility pace passing crossing ball control creativity long shots first <coughs> touch acceleration and work rates his weakness is aerial duels so so i'm assuming he must be a little bit shorter uh, shows he's 5'11", 161 pounds. He plays right wing. He's uh, left-footed. And now I'm starting to slowly see where the comparisons with Lionel Messi that I've seen in some of the comments of this video is coming from. You know, he's not I mean, quite as short as Messi, but... Being that he's 16 and he's still steadily working out, he can grow some more. Oh, yeah. Oh, he could definitely get he an definitely extra couple more, more inches. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. All right. So let's keep it going. Similar comparison to Ryan Maurice. Bit, but uh, I'm gonna mess up people's names. I'm not even gonna try. Y'all know who it Baki, is. Bakayoko, Bakayoko, and Estavo, Estavo. Forty-nine appearances, seven goals, seven assists, eighty-three percent pass uh, success, six yellow cards, two dribbles per game. Mark about at seven million. Wow. Okay. Rating seven point zero seven. Playing, I believe, for Barcelona. Yeah. See what he's got here. Yeah. Good little cheeky Quick touch. Step. Good pass. Yeah. Good speed on the outside. A little miss hesitation. Able to get work it in. Oh, oh good nice pass. pass. Nice pass. Wow. Nice touch on that pass. Ooh. That was clean. I love little moments like that are like very simple, but at a younger age, and he's playing with people that are older than him. To just kind of have the the patience to, yeah, to do that patience, move yeah. is actually is actually very impressive for someone at his age. Yeah, you can see it. Nice pass. <laughs> yeah, that was that was nice pass. pass. <laughs> Cuts back in, dribble inside the box, keeping it on his feet. Okay. Oh, 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 this guy here, buddy. <laughs> oh, man, that was that was that was probably like the nicest little reel we've had of him so far. And just dropped the ball on the, uh, on the finish. Good little left, uh, oh, left footed flick. Set up too. Yeah, should have did a header. That would have been better for a header. Good composure on the shot. Very nice, very nice. Yeah, good first touch over the defender. Create space. I love what he does out on the wing, man. Very composed. And, like, there's even certain moments where, like, his first touch is really good and that second touch is almost a little off. Like, you can mm -hmm. tell in certain moments that, like, either will, like, bounce, like, over or under his foot. Not exactly where he wants to, but he he's very composed. I'll say that again because that's what I'm noticing the most. And then he gathers himself back up and then is able to get the ball in a favorable position for him to either play it in or to dribble it down the sideline or find an open player. I got you. I got you. Yeah, very simple. 
Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Still try. I like that. Real simple pass. Not trying to force anything too crazy. And I love how he's always looking to get his team involved. Mm -hmm. I will say, he doesn't seem like a me player, so I like that. Yeah. Good try on the header. Yeah. Good work. Yeah, a little good little dummy. Good cross, all the way across there. <laughs> it's a nice setup. Yeah, a little, little right place at the right time over there. Yeah. A little heel flick. Nice. Mm. Yeah, good first touch, long first touch. Great separation, love that. See how he looks on the defense. Yeah, not bad. That was it. First of all, that I know we're talking, we're we're checking out uh, the mind. I was gonna say that was a, a phenomenal first touch by the forward there. Yeah, <laughs> that was a great first touch. The the one thing I'm noticing and like you know the one that we got to remember too is watching us. He's young. He's 16. He's 16 I yeah. believe that this is I believe this is U18. I was trying to see if I can get some more information on it before we uh before we covered it, but I believe this is him playing with the U18s. And I'm trying to picture myself whenever I was 16 playing. Obviously, like I wasn't extremely good, but I played against a lot of really good, or a lot played with and against a lot of really good players. Yeah. And the control he has with the ball is the one thing that sticks with me right now. Every touch he has is staying right in front of him. Nothing moves within a uh, you know a yard of wherever mm -hmm. he's at. Um, it, it shows a lot of potential. And like I feel like once his confidence grows and is feels comfortable taking a little bit more risk things will get really get turned up for him because he already has that mentality like you said of finding his teammates not being a yeah. selfish player really trying to look at making his other teammates better and doing that from the white right wing is super important you know they'll be I the like, main I, like his, um, I think what also help him go a long way is his patience his patience with the ball that's mm -hmm. i mean for somebody being that young to have that kind of patience the way he's looking right now that's impressive mm -hmm. yeah absolutely that was a great first touch. I can't believe he yeah. missed that finish. Yeah, again, nice moves. Yeah, cool. yeah, cool. yeah, cool. okay. Now, big touch right there. He does big touch right there. He's gone. Yeah. Oh, cheeky little cross. Still get to take some goals, though. A little hockey assist. slow motion there i'm mad at it though <laughs> very, very composed again yeah good touch that should be a pk good cross inside needs to be a little bit longer on that one but it was a good idea Good pass. Oh. On the beat. <laughs> Soccer players. <laughs> Go down any touch. Get to it. Show there speed. Show speed. I wish. Oh, I, I need. I need. I need, I need the compilation. Just extend about just a little bit longer. I yeah. want to see his speed. I want to see some of that aspect of him too. I've seen him be technical. I've seen him do the short little dribbles and the, you know the good one touch. I want to see him hit the guns up a bit too. Yeah, it should. You, it, if they're gonna do one like this, it should be more of a technique video where you're seeing the long play. It's like if you do a highlight for a person trying to get into NFL. You're not. It's not a highlight because you're seeing the full extent of the play. So you're seeing everything he does with the ball or without the ball. So that's what yeah. I would like to see. Yeah. Yeah. Same. Cut. Oh, good. Oh, yeah, like right nice. there. Why do I get to see what happens? Like, I don't even care if he messed it up, but I want to see. Yeah, I want to see how he finishes. I yeah. want to see how he finishes that because that's a nasty move he pulled right there. Yeah.
fake kick, turn around, another hesitation, moves back towards the corner. That's a great pass. Mm -hmm. It's so funny. You see how, like, it, it's... You watch him baby face, like like he doesn't even like he can grow facial hair yet, and you see one day right next to him with a full blown thick mustache, <laughs> like you could be combing it on the sidelines. <laughs> oh, about the handball there. Yeah, good turn touch. Let's see him take a shot from right there as well. There we go. Oh, Ooh. it's just off the crossbar. Finish. There, there we go. go. That nice. ball. Very nice. Back post. Yep. A little hesitation just to get him the move. Nice okay. That far out. We we started to see him. We started come, see him come into himself now. Yeah. I wonder. I wonder if this compilation is actually like a timeline, right? I wonder if this is showing from like mm. early games and then going through, because like we're starting to progressively see him almost get a little more comfortable. And if that is yeah. what they're doing, then this is actually really nice because we're seeing yeah. it be more and more comfortable, taking more risks, taking more tips, more at, at shots yeah. on goals. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah? Okay. I'm going to circles around, huh? Good ball. On the beat. I need some more aggressiveness on that header, though. Yeah. I love that again. Like he definitely, if he wanted to, if he was a more greedy player, he definitely could have pulled that back in and then worked back out to the right side as that person was mm -hmm. hedging up to him a little bit too close. But instead, he does the right play. He sees the open hand, so his instant thought is, "How can I slip it to this guy now?" Like he probably could have sent it. He probably should took one more touch. Uh, I'm putting pointing my finger dang to the mouse instead of his <laughs> mouse. But say he wants to. He sees the hand, so he instantly knows he wants to try and split these defenders and send it to the back side of him. He probably should have took a a like outside foot touch to bring the ball more here, and then and then put that and slip through. Forward. But yeah. I love how again you're gonna see this guy pull up on him, and he could have pulled back and went back out right, but instead he wants to look for his, his teammate. If it could have been done just a little bit quicker, a little bit quicker, yeah. then it'd have been money. Yeah, good finish. Mm. Absolutely. Okay. A little dip on the ball. Yeah, come on now. Oh, what a nice pass. Hold up. That a little heel flick? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's nice. It's interesting. He plays right wing, but they said he's left footed, right? Mm hmm. I think that's what they said, yeah. I wonder if they, I wonder why they have him out on the right if, if he's left footed. I wonder if it's a thing where they already have a, a left footed player that's been there for a while, so they have him out on the left. Oh, they maybe. Give him time to shine. Yeah. Maybe. Or maybe he just prefers the right. Maybe he's good with both feet. That could definitely be, be the thing, too. 
Or it yeah. could be because of his shot opportunities. We'd like to see him come across the uh, top of the box going this way, and then he can get a left foot on it and, and get a good shot to the back post. So it could be that too. True. Yeah, makes sense. As we'll see here. Oof. That was close. Oh. <laughs> outside the box yeah good little dummy yeah <laughs> got a break him. good pass mm. I think that's what it is, man. He finishes from that right side so often. Yeah. He's just comfortable on that side. Mm -hmm. Like, it could have been something that even when he was younger, he always played on that side because that's where they put him. Yeah. Even Very well, could be. Yeah. Deadly from that area, man. Yeah. Good little move. Good placement. Oh, that's an excellent <laughs> cross. Surprising to take yeah. a shot from there, to be honest, but that's just an excellent cross. And again, that goes back to him being a very unselfish player. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, stay on your feet. Great. It's like those simple things, and like I know it's not like super high high quality as far as like you know professionals and stuff like that. But to have yeah. you know your face to the ball, back to the person uh, that you're gonna be passing it to, and just to be able to so quickly uh, take on that that pass from the front here. To turn and just immediately after one touch send that ball exactly where it needs to be. It, oh yeah, very I hard I to do. Too. Yeah, two touches, splits the two defenders. Couldn't be any better than that. I swear because that ball looks like it goes up the side and, and goes in front of the player. Yeah, that's, that's what right. it looks it like. Just... It looks like it goes around him in, in front of the, his teammate. It looks, I was like, that looks so crazy from that angle. It's nice. <laughs> <laughs> like, <"God> damn it. <laughs> <laughs> pass again. Very accurate passing. They said what eighty six percent is his accuracy passing. Very I think good. it's eighty six. Yeah. Mm. Oh, nice move. Ah, I just lost it though. You got, you got grabbed up by the jersey. You got to fight yeah, through that. Good pulling jersey. Yeah, good defense to keep the ball down on your side. Or on their side. Got him the jump. Nice. You can That's see nice. the games when he has like a bit of confidence in him, right? Like you yeah. can see, you know, there's certain moments where his arms are a little bit looser, like he's playing with mm -hmm. he's playing less stiff. Is is definitely fun to watch him come on come yeah, into his own. Oh, Absolutely. Got to go to reach it. <laughs> absolutely. Got to absolutely. Reach it. I mean, look. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, he's nice. He's nice. Yeah, Lamond Le Yamal, man. Let us know what y'all yeah. think of the comments. I know, like, at least I'm assuming that this is, like, in, in soccer, football, like it is for us in, like, U.S. sports, especially with basketball, where once one player is coming near the end of his his career, like we had with Michael Jordan, everybody's trying to find the next Michael Jordan. The next, LeBron yeah. coming into his career now, so they're always mm -hmm. trying to find the new LeBron now. Yeah. And it's like sometimes that name gets thrown around too much to anyone that shows, you know, a hint of talent. Uh, but yeah. I think what he has is very special because, you know, just like I said, from the things that he does right is the things that a lot of younger people, 
people do not, which is getting your teammates sure. involved, accurate passing, uh, very good control of the ball, all those things that I see. Um, mm -hmm. I, I think it'd be exciting to see where he can turn out in the next couple of years. Oh, he definitely has confidence in, in the field, so that's a good thing, especially to be 16 playing with older players. Yeah, and he, to, to stand out, that's the key. He and stands stand out. out. So, yeah. yeah, true, true. So appreciate you, Sajith, for that recommendation. Yeah, Guys, thank you, sir. Let, let us know if there's any other videos you, you would like us to check out. Like I said, request form down below. And also in the comments if you're still here, let us know what your thoughts are of Lamine Yamal and what do you think he could be in the next year? What's his professional comparison? Let us know in the comments. Appreciate you guys. Love you guys. Catch you on the next one. Cheers. Peace out.